Here's a quick walk around of the uh, of the RS500. It's nearly finished. As you can see, the the engine's all in place now. Got a new uh, new fuel tap. Um, freshly freshly painted tank. Got, uh, I've got an uprated uh, front brake. The disc is actually from a, a Honda FMX 650. Um, it's slightly modified to fit, but uh, not much. I'm waiting for a, a caliper. I'm going to use a Honda NC30 caliper. Um, I'll have to make a bracket, an adapter bracket to suit. But apart from that, it's nearly done. Uh, just needs an MOT. I'll turn it round so uh, you can see uh, see the other side as well. I've had it running and uh, it uh, sounds okay. So obviously, I haven't been out on it yet with a, without a front brake, but. Uh, Started it in the garage, and um, it took a little while to get going. But once once it was once it was up and running, it seemed all right. So just turn it round, and here it is from the other side. I think it looks almost uh, almost factory built. There is a company uh, on the internet that will make up stickers uh, of any design you want. I'm just wondering whether to get uh, get some of these made up instead of CB250 RS, CB500 RS. See how much they cost. Your tank's looking good. My dad sprayed that for me. Trouble is now it makes the rest of it look a bit, um, a bit tatty. I'll have to give him the, uh, the plastics and get him to do them as well. These are these are actually standard footrests that I've uh, machined out the centre where the sticker is, um, and then cut it here, cut a section out, angled it up. Uh, and then got it welded and then sprayed in the two pack silver. So, uh, just adds a bit of lightness, I think. Right. Next stop, get it out on the road. <laughs> 